Hello everyone, today with MarketXLS we're going to talk about a very popular options trading strategy known as the Synthetic Short Straddle with Coles Option Strategy. MarketXLS is one of the top Excel-based investment research solution for investors. It makes it easier for you to turn your Excel skills and market knowledge into profit. In this video we'll be learning what a Synthetic Short Straddle with Coles Option Strategy is, how it works, when to use this strategy, what is the range of returns, and finally we'll understand how MarketXLS can help investors to implement this strategy in an effortless manner. So without any further ado, let's start with the topic. This strategy is used when the trader believes the underlying asset will not move significantly over the lives of the options contracts. This strategy is used by traders when they are expecting a low volatility period of the underlying asset. A synthetic short straddle with calls is an options strategy comprised of being long on stock and simultaneously selling two lots of ATM call options. The maximum loss is unlimited if the stock moves in a direction sharply. The maximum profit is limited if the stock remains in a range. As long as the market does not move up or down in price, the short straddle trader is perfectly fine. The trader will incur losses if the stock shows volatility in its price. MarketXLess offers a template for this strategy. Here's an introduction page of the template and here's the active template. The yellow cells have to be inputted by the user, so the stock ticker, expiry date, ATM strike price, the price at which the user entered the short position of the stock and the number of stocks for which the long position was taken. Some upcoming expiry dates, the current share price and lot size are available for the investor's reference on the right. For the purpose of this video, we'll be using Microsoft expiry date as 16 April and we'll be selling two lots of ATM put options at 245 strike price. And now in order to hedge our position, we'll be long on stock and simultaneously sell two lots of ATM call options. The net cash flow would come out as 2,270, which is the result obtained when we multiply the number of units, the lot size, and the premium. MarketXLS has many templates, just like the synthetic short straddle with Coles one that you see here and it refreshes all the data when you click on the Refresh All button. A net payoff table and a net payoff diagram are available to help the user observe the potential profit or loss at different expiry levels. The user has to enter the inputs of the minimum and maximum payoff profile. The table contains the net payoff of the strategy at different expiry prices. In the chart, the y-axis is the net payoff of strategy and the x-axis is the range of expiry prices. Maximum loss occurs at the strike price. As we can see, this strategy earns maximum profits at expiration if the underlying stock expires below the upper breakeven point or above the lower breakeven point. That is all for today. We hope we were able to help you understand how to use MarketXLS for the synthetic short straddle with Coles option strategy. If you want to read more about this topic, please visit the MarketXLS website, which has hundreds of blogs and templates. And if you want to get in contact with us, please book a demo and we'll be happy to help.